Yongo Hwewa Level Three Power English. Welcome to the show, everybody. Hi, everyone. I'm Kristen Cho, and I'm Cameron Word.、Uh, on Thursdays, we have a specific set of dialogues.、Mm-hmm. The topic is usually wellness or health or fitness related topics. Yes. And this month, we're talking about grounding. Yes. Okay.、Uh, and the subtitle is "The Results Are Backed Up by Scientific Data." So grounding in Korean right now is grounding. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah,、mm. it's because it's kind of、mm. a it's a new concept、mm-hmm. uh, in the U.S. as well. So we had the word grounding before, but that meant to like. Be grounded by your parents, yeah, like, yeah, to not be able to do something, right, 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 as a punishment. That's right. But now, even though it's the same word with the same spelling, it has this meaning now to、mm-hmm. walk around、mm-hmm. in dirt and other natural surfaces, right, barefoot, right. And the point that the dialogue is going to make is that the results are backed up by scientific data.、Mm-hmm. So 결과가과학적데이터로뒷받침되다Yeah. Right.、Mm-hmm. Okay. So there is evidence.、Mm. It's backed up by scientific data. Backed up is actually one of our expressions today. Yes. So if it's backed up by scientific data, what does this mean? It means that it is supported、mm-hmm. by research. So、yeah. here in the title, we have backed up by,、mm-hmm. and then in our power expressions, we have backed by.、Mm-hmm. Uh, they both mean the same thing in this case. Okay. Very good. So it's so grounding is not just some concept. It is real scientific stuff. That's what it's saying.、Mm-hmm. Okay, if you incorporate something into something, so incorporate A into B. Yes. Okay. What are you doing? You're including or adding to. Yes.、Mm-hmm. It is not replacing.、Mm-hmm. It is adding to something. Adding to. Okay.、Mm-hmm. Play a role in something. It means to help with something.、Mm-hmm. There's some goal, and to play a role means it is helping you get to that goal. And role is spelled R O L E. Yes. Okay. Let's go ahead and listen to our power dialogue. I thought maybe the placebo effect was how grounding worked, so I researched it more. What did you find? The results are backed by scientific data. People actually do experience changes in their blood pressure, cortisol levels, and more from grounding. That's why I've been incorporating it into my daily routine for the last few months. If grounding can play a role in improving my health and well-being, I may do the same. And even if it doesn't do anything, it's still a peaceful practice. We're on page ninety-two. That's where you can find our, the power dialogue. Grounding the results are backed up by scientific data. Let's begin. Dora says, "I thought maybe the placebo effect was how grounding worked, so I researched it at home." Ooh, we've got some scientific、mm. terms here. Placebo effect. P L A C E B O, and then effect. Yes. Okay. What is placebo effect? That is our power vocab. So this is where you think something will happen,、mm-hmm. so it happens,、mm-hmm. even though there's not an actual reason. So、right. I think it's better to give this by example. The original placebo was a sugar pill,、mm-hmm. like a pill that you get at the doctor.、Mm-hmm. But instead of having real medicine in、mm-hmm. it, it just had sugar or something that has no real effect.、Mm-hmm. But people would take the medicine, and they would get better. Because they thought they were taking medicine, so it was a mental thing. Right, it、mm-hmm. was a mental thing. It wasn't actually there was no actual medicine in that. That pill, right? right? Right. So, in the same way, if we're talking about grounding, the placebo effect is: you think you would have a good result from this,、mm-hmm. so it gives you a good result in the sense of like it relaxes you,、mm-hmm. so it makes you feel better and、yeah. it decreases your tension. Right.、Mm-hmm. Right. So we think grounding is good for you, so it so I feel good. 
It just is kind of a mental thing. Right. So in Korean, they actually use the word placebo. So placebo. Placebo 효과. 효과, Yeah, that's Mm. right. So uh, we have that. And Luca says, what did you find? And what does Dora say? The results are backed by scientific data. Some people actually do experience changes in their blood pressure, cortisol levels, and more from grounding. Okay. So uh, is it placebo effect? And Doris is like, actually, we have scientific data. It's backed by scientific data. Yes. So here, backed by means supported by. Mm -hmm. So we often use this when we're talking about research. If something is backed by scientific data, Mm -hmm. it's saying they did an experiment and the results support Mm -hmm. this opinion. Mm -hmm. So that is what backed by means. Sometimes I see products and... In the advertisement, it says backed by, you know, dermatologists around Mm -hmm. the world Mm -hmm. or, you know, in the country. So it's almost as if they are are getting the support and the sponsorship Mm -hmm. from these doctors. Yes. That's what this uh, phrase backed by is saying. Okay. Now, here, our power pattern is people actually do experience changes. This is interesting because... People, we could just say people experience changes in their actually experience changes, but it says actually do experience. So actually do is our power pattern. Yes. So this pattern is used to strengthen a fact. It's Mm. there to emphasize that Mm. something is true. So with this grounding, it's throughout these dialogues, it's been a question are they really experiencing changes? Yeah. Is the blood pressure going down? Mm-hmm. Are their cortisol levels going down? Yeah. There was a question around it, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. And in this sentence, Doris is saying, no, yeah. No, they- yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Yes, yes, they do. <laughs> so that's what they actually do. People actually do experience. Mm-hmm. She's emphasizing that there's no question. Okay, yeah. it is a fact. Mm. Okay, so they do experience changes in blood pressure, uh, cortisol levels, and more from grounding. Lucas says, that's why I've been incorporating it into my daily routine for the last few months. Okay, Luca has a daily routine, mm-hmm. but he incorporated grounding into his daily routine. Yes. So based on your explanation, it means... You? Add to. Yes. Right? Mm. So incorporating to a daily routine means you're adding it to your daily routine. Yeah. You're not replacing it. You are you already have a routine yeah. and you're doing something, but maybe in the extra time that you have, you're mm-hmm. doing a little bit of this grounding. Okay. So we can use, you know, you can incorporate a lot of things into a lot of other things. So right. you can incorporate, uh, you know, more colors to the design. Yeah. Maybe it needs more brighter colors. Yeah. Or even in baking, you can incorporate ingredients, which means you're mixing ingredients together. So let's say you have a mixture and you want to incorporate flour into the mixture. Ooh, yeah. That's where you slowly stir in the flour into the other parts that you already have. Yeah. Fundamental baking 101 is that you take the wet ingredients Mm -hmm. and then you incorporate the dry ingredients. Yes. That's it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good example. Okay. What does Dora say? If grounding can play a role in improving my health and well-being, I may do the same. Okay. So... If grounding can play a role in improving my health and well-being. So mm-hmm. to play a role. Yes. 어떤 역할을 하는 거예요? Right. right. Uh-huh. So play a role. We often think of like a play, like a, yeah. a theater right. play, a mm. performance, right? Yeah. Where an actor plays a role. Right, right. But in this case, it is like grounding is one part of this effort to improve your health ah. and to improve your well-being. Got so it. it's not the only thing mm-hmm. that is helping, mm-hmm. but it is one part of the things that are helping you. It is playing a role. So Doris is saying, hey, if this really works, then yeah, I'll do it too. Mm-hmm. And Luca says, and even if it doesn't do anything, it's still a peaceful practice. Yeah. Mm. Just to go outside. Because, you know... We don't go outside. <laughs> most, I mean, we're most people, buildings. yeah. If you live in the city, definitely mm. it is hard to find a, mm. a nice, peaceful place to go. Right. But mm. you've got a lovely balcony. 
Mm. And so you can go outside. Well, there's construction. So there's, oh, there is? Like, ah, there's a lot of uh, okay. hammering going on Got right it. now. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and listen to that one more time. I thought maybe the placebo effect was how grounding worked. So I researched it more. What did you find? The results are backed by scientific data. People actually do experience changes in their blood pressure, cortisol levels, and more from grounding. That's why I've been incorporating it into my daily routine for the last few months. If grounding can play a role in improving my health and well-being, I may do the same. And even if it doesn't do anything, it's still a peaceful practice. It's time for Power Note. We're on pages 94 and 95. Our first expression that we covered was backed by something. It means that it is supported and proven Mm -hmm. by facts. Yes. Okay? So we... There is some credibility, like we can believe it. Mm -hmm. How did you win the fraud lawsuit? Our charges were backed by evidence of their wrongdoing. Okay. Backed by evidence. Right? Yes. You have chingle. Yeah. Okay? Mm -hmm. That's enough to win the lawsuit. Mm -hmm. Okay. His claim that he was a great tennis player was backed by a cabinet full of trophies. Mm. This is an interesting way of using this. Yeah. Yeah. It's supported by. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what is it? (laughs) Sounds really funny. I was watching this documentary about Simone Biles. Yes. The gymnast. Me too. And she just said, I'm the greatest gymnast of all time. And people were mad at her. Yeah. Because she's like, how can you say you're the greatest gymnast? Yeah. That's so, we use the word conceited. Yeah. She's a talent Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And she goes, um, I can say it because it's backed by all of the number one positions I've gotten in world championships. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's literally in the record books it's how many so times true. she's won. It's backed by her, you know, performance. Right. It was very refreshing. It wasn't like she was trying to brag. She was like... It's just factual. I literally have more awards than anyone ever. Right, right. (laughs) It's backed by fact. Uh, When I taught academic writing Uh at IHWA, um, and, you know, you teach them how to write an essay, Mm -hmm. and this word often comes up a lot. You can make a statement, but if you don't back it up with... You know, proper reasoning or logic. Yeah, it it's very weak. Yes, your argument has to be backed by yes facts, backed right. by reason, backed right. by logic. That's it. Mm. That's right. So that's a very common usage yep. as well. Mm-hmm. Okay, incorporate something into something means to involve, to add yes to it. I'm so stiff every day, doctor. What can I do? I'd like you to incorporate ten minutes of stretching into your morning routine. Okay incorporate 10 minutes of stretching. So she has already something that is the morning routine. Yes. Okay. But it, but maybe it's not exercise. Maybe it's drinking coffee, mm-hmm. washing your face, but she needs to do some stretches. Yes. Okay. We incorporated a team meeting into our f- Friday baseball practice. Mm. Already we have a practice on yes. Friday, mm-hmm. but we're going to add a team meeting. Yes. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Do you feel like there's anything that you need to incorporate into your morning or evening routine? Into my morning or evening routine? Yeah. I think that my evening routine, Mm. I feel I need to incorporate more preparation for the next day. Really? Yeah. So I I think it would be better, Uh, like things like having the clothes I'm going to wear or like, I think there are several things I could do before. Really? Yeah. 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 Or like I could probably, so I grind my coffee beans. Sure. Like every, I don't Me too, every day. Uh I think if I did that the night before. It would but be better. It loses the freshness, no, Cameron. No, because it's in a uh, airtight seal. Oh, okay, that's true. I got a true. container that like goes straight into it. Okay, you want to do it the night before? Because then I don't have to do it in the morning. Oh. I can drink my coffee and immediately go to the gym. Oh. Like it's one thing that like stops. Got it. So if it incorporated coffee grinding into my night routine, it'd make my morning routine easier. Okay. Here is something that I've incorporated into my morning routine. What? So instead of drinking coffee mm-hmm. at my desk or in the living room, 
I've incorporated into my morning walk. Oh yeah, take it outside. Yes, because the weather is so beautiful. Walk and drink. Walk and drink. Just don't spill it on yourself. I've done that already. <laughs> Oh I no, have, I hope you didn't have, ruin any clothing. I have spilled a few times, ah. but it's okay. It's okay. I've incorporated that into my routine mm. as well as kind of sitting at a park or like on the grass and drinking my coffee outside mm. instead of inside the house. Isn't that nice? Yeah, that is good. Yeah. As long as it's warm enough. Yeah, I don't know. I think for winter, we're right, going to have to change. In the middle of winter, <laughs> we might have to think of another way. That's right. Yeah. Okay. We can also incorporate some things here at Power English. Yeah. Well, we try to incorporate humor into the show. Oh, absolutely. We try to add a little, some jokes, mm -hmm. add some fun. Sure. Yeah. Sure. And that's what makes Power English special. Now, if you play a role in something, it means that you are involved directly in something. Yes. Uh, You're what helping you, to achieve a goal. All right. What do you think was the main cause of the team's losing season? A lack of discipline played a role for sure. Okay. So this is one factor mm -hmm. that led to the team losing. Yeah, that's one reason. It helped them to a bad thing, yeah. essentially. <laughs> a lack of discipline. Yeah. Okay. Good genetics played a role in Hank's athletic ability. Mm. Yeah, yeah, if you're tall. That definitely helps you play basketball. Oh, sure, yeah, sure. Yeah, it will play a role. Mm -hmm. But it isn't everything. That's right. Because I'm tall, but I'm awful at basketball. Oh, really? I can't jump. Oh. So I'm... <laughs> but you can dribble the ball. I No, I can't. No? I hit my feet. <laughs> RPD. Can I just tell you? Can I just tell everybody? Uh -huh. Our JBPD. He can dribble a ball. Oh, yeah. I mean... He's so fast. He's so much better than me. I know. Uh -huh. He's so great. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, our power pattern today is actually do, which means it's used to emphasize a point. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Some people actually do enjoy going to the dentist. Mm. I do. Some parts I do like... When they floss your teeth for you, uh, they stick the string in between your teeth. Yeah. And they, <laughs> I do I like it. a good cleaning. Mm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't like the other treatments, but the cleaning after, oh, it feels so good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dogs actually do have a better sense of smell than most other animals. Oh, yeah. It's like, do they really? I don't know. Do they? You know what? I go, they, they really do. They I actually go <laughs> do. There was a question, and now there's not a question. This fact is true. I almost, I almost like, huh? I didn't know what you were saying. Yes. Good job mm -hmm. acting there. Thank okay, you. Okay, Cameron. Thank you. All right. Power vocab today is placebo effect, and that's on page 96. There's a nice definition there. Mm -hmm. You may already know what that means already, but do check it out in English. Yes. Okay? And also check out... Very good. That's a wrap for 